Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown, extended, beautiful family, just thank you so much for the love and support that you're giving me and you're giving yourself. You know, I'm hoping and praying all your wishes and the things that you want and need in life come true. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video also if you have been um if you are comfortable enough please drop me a line or two I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up tell me about your impact and gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction also, if you feel like the video gives you good vibes or good information that, you know, a fellow empath needs to hear at that time, or you just know that somebody needs to hear encouraging words, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites, wherever you see fit. And thank you so much for stopping by the channel and showing me so much love and support. It, it truly, you know, makes me feel blessed. I greatly appreciate it. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And today... My meditation um, comes from uh, med uh, Meditative Mind, Sofigo, 432 Hertz. Uh, secret Cosmic Garden, Raise Your Positive Energy Vibrations, and Beautiful Mallet Meditation Music is, uh, is the meditation. So I will post that link in the description box below. And today my video is about Twin Flame 101, Hey Oka, Signs of Encouragement Show Up. Uh, right when you you're ready to give up yes they always do you know I, don't, I must be on something good because that light just went pew, you know uh there's a lot of us that goes on in life you know even i've been like that where i felt like i just wanted to give up you know sometimes i have to go back and watch my videos and watch myself like have that self-talk with myself like you, you there's too many things that you have too many cons not i mean pros for you to be wanting to give up just because you have like a few little cons you shouldn't do that you know um when you know you're going towards something good i tell y'all all the time devil and darkness does not like you you changing ego does not like you changing you know there will be negative people they'll be in your life they'll be those naysayers because they don't see their dreams coming true they want to sit up here and crush yours don't do that just because something didn't work out for them doesn't mean it won't work out for you you know everybody do things differently you know, if you really truly want something in life, you know, you get those encouragements. You watch my videos, you're on social media, and you'll see certain, um, like, so, certain posts, you know, like with me. I, you know, I try to give encouraging words, positive words, but I also put, you know, positive meditations in the background. So, you know, while you're hearing that, you're feeling the vibes that's coming through. And on top of that, you know, I try to put little pictures or posts, you know, on my thumbnail. Uh, just to give you words of encouragement as well, you know, because we all need that in our life, especially with us hey Okas, we, we always pick the hardest way to do stuff, and it's just like, I, I be looking at y'all, like, well, I be doing it myself, I'm like, why do you do that, you know, you could have just went and did this, but no, you want to pick the high road to be doing that, All you know, all you had to do is just cross the street, but no, you chose to take this mountaintop, and you really didn't have to go that route, but you know, that shows you strength and endurance, even though you didn't have to go that way, it's, it's like, we pick the harder things because it, it gives us more strength when we usually do that. When, you know, this is not really giving us the lesson we really need to go across that street. We have to take that mountaintop. We have to go engage and find out why is this like that and why is that like this and all those different things. But, you know, everything happens for a reason. You know, we, we go through different things. We have to experience certain things that, you know, that was tend to break us, you know, for us to, you know, go crazy or whatever. But it's just like when I first started, you know, YouTube, I was, you know, researching a lot of things and, you know, I cried a lot of times because it was a blessing, you know, to be able to find out, you know, there was nothing wrong with me. I was just going through a spiritual awakening. You know, my dad was there spiritually for me, you know, and universe was there bringing things to me and saying, hey, look at this. Or I'll be hearing certain things, and I'm just like, okay, what is this? And they say, well, obviously, duh, go look it up, <laughs> you know. And there'll be next thing you know, I'll find out. I'm like, wow, this resonates with me, uh, in in many different ways. And it's just like, you know, y'all just don't know. I mean, it's a blessing 
that I'm able to do this because when I was coming out, I didn't have somebody personally I can talk to, you know, being able to do one-on-ones with, you know, there was a lot of people I didn't really trust um, with uh, what I was experiencing because I didn't want to be locked up. I didn't want people to think I was crazy or something like that. But then to be able to, you know, start doing video diaries. And then when I started seeing YouTube, you know, YouTubers that were motivational speakers or even seeing it on Facebook. And I was like, you know what, this is something I want to do and didn't realize this is what I was going to end up doing in the first place. And just being able to see, you know, the overwhelming comments that, you know, y'all send me and the good vibes and the blessings that you, you give me back. You know, there's days I don't sat here and cried and had to thank God, you know, for y'all. Because I didn't realize it would make this big of an impact the way, you know, I was not expecting this. And there's times I want to cry. You know, I mean, right now I'm trying to fight back the tears because, I, I mean, I'm, I'm hearing and feeling the vibes that I'm getting constantly all the time. Even when I'm making the videos, I feel people coming towards my way that haven't even, you know, seen the video yet. Or, you know, just being able to give you that peace of mind to know that, you know, there's more than life than what we expect. You know, there's, we have to look at the bigger picture, knowing, you know, if nothing's going to come to us easy, if it's something that's going to bring, bring about a big change to you, you might be praying for something and you get something where you totally weren't even expecting, you know, that is a blessing, you know, within a blessing within itself. And I know I keep saying that, but it is, um, you know, you never should give up on things, you know, if it's going to, you know, pull you out of certain situations you really don't deserve to be in. You know, we've been, we've been in a certain vibe for so long that, you know, when we switch it up, yeah, it feels uncomfortable. Yeah, it feels foreign to us because if you're, you're sitting in a dark place that you really don't deserve to be in, you know, when you're finally saying enough is enough is enough. I, I need change in my life. I need happiness in my life. You know, I don't know why things are the way they are, but I'm ready for a change. And when you know you're going for that, you know, some people get blessed and, Things happen for them overnight, but others that, you know, it takes time for things to happen because, you know, you have so much things that are coming towards your way. It might take a little bit longer for everything to fall into place for you, but that doesn't mean you need to give up because you never know, you know, 444, you know, I'm a number girl. You know, when you see 444, you never know what's going on behind the scenes. You never know what universe is trying to set up for you and your loved ones to be able to be blessed that way. So you never should give up on things like that. You know, you, you, when you feel like, you know, you're you're out at wit's end or you feel like I can't go no more. There's always something that is going to pop into your life to tell you, what are you doing? <laughs> you got too many beautiful things that are ahead for you down this road. You might not know where this road is taking you. You may not know, understand the purpose on the things you had to go through. But there's obviously there's a bigger picture you're not able to see at that time. Or if you're in your feelings, you're not going to be able to see it. Um, there, even though the signs could be right there, you know. Like I said before, there's people that are okay being depressed. And they just want to keep, oh, woe is me. You know, the sound like um, Igor from, you know, Winnie the Pooh. I, I mean, it's just, I feel bad for people like that. But then I don't feel sorry for them at, you know, other times either. Because you're not giving yourself that chance to get out of that situation. You're so busy looking negative. You're not trying to give a different route a chance you know and it's just like uh like i told y'all before i've you know i've had people like that in my life that i truly love but they look at things so negatively i have to walk away at times you know i, I get like that myself but myself and then i gotta smack myself like what are you doing you know get out that rut you know there there's bigger and better things that are heading towards you but you know you're gonna have things thrown in your path in your path because you know darkness you know darkness and you know the devil and god are playing hand hand in hand you know and their darkness don't want you to do that especially when they know you're playing a major part in something when you're that ace card and you that spade card they know you're gonna be that one that always trumps everything else oh yeah they're gonna make sure that you don't win they're gonna make it hard for you just because they know how much of an impact you're gonna be so don't give up. Don't let, let these naysayers put anything in your head. Don't allow your ego to get the best of you because your ego will do that. You know, especially if you've been in a situation for so long and you try to switch up and be positive. It, that's a whole new shock for them. It's just like you're sticking yourself in cold water and like, oh, what are you doing? You know, it's just like, uh-uh, uh-uh, I'm not used to this. 
I like you where you were. You know, no, no, don't do that. You know, because where you were were wasn't helping you at all. It kept you stagnant. It kept on having you go through that rotating door, rotating door. When you actually, you know, finally walk out that door and say, you know what, I'm not coming back to this door no more. You know, I, I got better things wait, waiting on the other end for me. Even though I might not know where this road is leading me, obviously it's drawing me to go this way for a reason. You know, when you know you're heading towards something good, you'll see how things start really working your last nerve. And you're just, I'll be looking at certain situations I'm in and it's just like, it could be something that's thrown off me or, you know, um, it could be my, my, you know, my computer cutting off on me, especially when I know I've, I've got some big, nice videos out there that, you know, going to really make a difference to somebody, you know, the computer will cut off or, you know, I got to re-upload certain things. It's just like that, especially with YouTube, you know, they be messing with you at times and it's just like, oh, whatever, you know, I'm just keep doing me because I know there, <laughs> you know, there's things going to happen. It, it's life. It, it, you're not going to always have a good day, but you should be able to be patient with yourself when you're having a bad one, you know, still thank God or universe, or whoever you, you choose to see fit, that you, you know, thank you for letting me get through this day, you know, I got to tell them all the time, and sometimes I fall short on not being grateful, and I try to be most grateful as I am, being able to make these videos, being able to give that word of encouragement to somebody to let them know, hey, things are getting better, but don't give up on yourself, don't, don't do that, if this is that sign you're looking for, this is it, don't do it, you got better things waiting on, on the, you know, down the line for you, you know, there, I've seen so many posts where, I don't know if y'all ever seen this post, where you see this guy digging, digging and digging, and he's like right there by the diamonds and blessings right there, and he turned right around, while the other person is still digging right there, and he right there about to, you know, he's coming up to the to the diamond. You never know how much, how close you are to your blessings if you turn around and go back. You know, there's so many people that got scared. You know, there was a lot of people that, that could have been really successful, and they 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 gave up because things got too hard or it got too risky. It makes life all worthwhile. You know, when you can finally say, when all these things, can, you know, I even tell my kids that all the time when everything's said and done and you get to where you need to get you and you did that on your own guess what hey, nobody can sit up here and say hey if they didn't have this they would never you know if I wouldn't have had you know helped then they would have never got this you know if it wouldn't have been for these people telling me no I wouldn't have been that one that told myself yes you know I'm glad that people you know there's what my situation goes on especially with my dad you know, being able to have all these situations where I was able to get blessed, but there was something that turned me down. I used to get upset about that because I'm just like, this is my family. I have every right to know them. But it's just like, even when people in my mom's camp that knew about my situation, she already told them if something ever happens to me and, you know, she doesn't meet her father, please help her get there. There was people that know about that and just don't want to say nothing because they see how much my dad's worked and they don't want to see me happy like that. That's okay. That's fine. It's all in dandy. So when I, you know, when my blessings come, I don't want them knocking on my door. The same people that knew something, I don't want you to come knocking on my door. I don't want that. <laughs> you know, I'm like, I'm just keep doing me. But, you know, I can sit up here and say everything I did was on my own. I never gave up. Even though it got hard, I, you know, it happened, it happened. But I never gave up. And that's what you need to tell yourself. So I'm running this video a little bit longer than I expected. So like and subscribe. I hope you're able to resonate with this. So don't give up on anything that you really truly want better. This is going to better your life and better your loved ones. So don't do that. Um, drop me a line. I would love a chance to hear from you. Like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And, you know, make sure you, you drop me a line so I can go ahead and give you a post notification shout out. Um, Jurassic Mark. Michelle Olsen. Uh... Alexandria Silva, much love to you. Send out as much love and light positivity as you possibly can. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And knowing I am truly praying for y'all some better days. I pray for everybody. So I'll talk to you later. Much love. Peace. Be well.